happy friends. Look at these images. It's the universe. Can you see all the stars it has? There are millions and millions. And it's beautiful, isn't it? But let's get closer to a very special star. This is the sun, the most important star in the universe. Let's get to know a little more. The sun is the closest star to Earth. That's why it looks like the largest and the brightest one. But that's not true. There are many stars a lot bigger than the sun. But they are so far away, that's why we see them so small. The sun is the most important star because it gives us light, heat and energy. And thanks to it, we have life on our planet. The Earth! Look, if we move away from the Earth, we can see there are lots of asteroids that are orbiting the Sun. These asteroids and the Sun itself is what we call Solar System. In the Solar System, there are eight planets. And they are all, all, moving around the sun. Do you know what this movement that they make? And you can see in the images is called... Well, it's called... Rotation Movement. Because they are rotating around the sun. But do you know what the planets are called? No? Well, we'll introduce each one of them. Mercury, Venus, Earth, our planet, yes, where we live, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Now, let's revise. The Sun is a star. And thanks to it, there is life on planet Earth. The solar system is the sun and all asteroids moving around it. And it has eight planets. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. Ah, oh, I almost forgot. The movement all planets make around the sun is called rotation movement. Goodbye, happy friends. Search us and subscribe to Happy Learning's YouTube channel. Hello, friends, and welcome to a new Happy Learning video. Today, we're going to learn about the most important star in the universe. Today, we're going to study the Sun. The Sun is a star, an enormous sphere of extremely hot gas, which is continuously shining and spinning around. It seems much bigger and brighter than any other star, but that is only because our planet is close to it. More so, than to any other star. The Sun is in the center of our system and that's why we call it the Solar System and all the planets in it revolve around the Sun. It has been shining in space for more than four and a half billion years. Yup, I said B for billion and scientists claim it will continue to do so for another 5 billion years. 
It's incredible! The sun is composed of gas. The majority of this gas is hydrogen and helium, though there is also some carbon, nitrogen and oxygen. It shines so brightly and transmits so much energy because in its interior they are atomic reactions which turn the hydrogen into helium. To give you an idea, the surface temperature on the Sun is 5,800 degrees Celsius. In only one second, more energy is released from the Sun than that which has been consumed by all humanity so far. Just in one second! Compared to the Earth, the Sun is enormous. 1,300,000 planets the size of our Earth can fit inside the Sun. It is also very far from our planet. Do you know how long it would take us to get to the Sun? Well, considering that the Sun is 150 million kilometers away, if we would travel from the Earth to the Sun by car at a speed of 100 kilometers an hour, we would take 170 years to get there. Though the light that the Sun emits doesn't take that long to get to the Earth, it takes only 8 minutes for the light to travel from the moment it leaves the Sun till it reaches our planet. That's 300,000 kilometers per second. It's absolutely mind-blowing! It can circle the world 7 times in 1 second. There is most definitely nothing faster than light. So now we have learnt a little more about the Sun, our star and about light. I hope you found it all very interesting. Goodbye friends! Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to Happy Learning TV! Search us and subscribe to Happy Learning's YouTube channel. Hello everyone! Today we're going to learn about the solar system. As you know, the Sun is a star, one of many stars that form the Milky Way. But for us, it's the most important star shining in the sky. Planets move around the Sun, and so do comets and asteroids. Well, the Sun and everything that revolves around it is what we call the solar system. The most interesting things that we should know about the solar system are the planets. Let's look at them. Starting with the ones closest to the Sun and then getting further away. The closest planet to the Sun is Mercury. Then there is Venus. Then comes the Earth, yes, our planet where we live. Then there is Mars. Jupiter, the largest planet, Saturn, Uranus, and then the furthest away is Neptune. As you can see, Mercury, Venus, Earth and Mars are closer to the Sun and also smaller than Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. One important thing you should know is that the journey that all planets make around the Sun is called an orbit. Now a question. Do you know where the days of the week get their names from? Well, if we think about it for a minute, the Moon, which is not actually a planet itself but Earth's natural satellite, gives its name to Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday come from ancient British gods that were related to the planets Mars, Mercury, Jupiter and Venus. Saturday gets its name from Saturn and of course the Sun itself gives us the name Sunday. So if you remember that there is also Uranus, Neptune and our own Earth, then you know all the names of the eight planets in the solar system. 
easy, eh? Goodbye for now, everyone. And don't forget to subscribe to Happy Learning. Search us and subscribe to Happy Learning's YouTube channel.